Hello and welcome back to Rustic Root Farm. It's been a couple of days. I've just been helping out uh, a friend. Uh, his farm needed a little bit of help. And my the door's open. Me and my partner, we've been helping out a friend. We're just now returning back to the farm. So we've been away just for three days. And one of our storage unit doors are open. We locked everything up. Okay, what's going on here? Nobody else has got key. Uh, I dropped my partner off over at her friend's house. She's that white house in the distance. She's over there. Uh, but John Deere Cedar has gone. That was left in there. Oh, please don't say we've had thieves come round and steal things. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, we're going to have to go round and get, just get out in a minute. Well, let's have a look at this door. Uh, it looks like someone tried getting in this door, but we did have the back of the door reinforced. Oh, yeah, someone's just broke in here. They broke the latch on this unit door. Oh no, you've got to be kidding. Really? Things have been stolen? The force rate harvester's gone? What the heck did they use? They took the harvester but they left the class? Why would they leave this one? Had the Capello header. Have they took, oh, they've took the header trailer for it. They've took the header. Looks like they took the corn header we had for it. They've took our tedder. Oh, what else have they taken? I'm trying to look. Oh, they've took our, uh, oh, the old Russell Mash KT-10 that we did for Total Mix Ration. Okay, they have took... Oh, they've just took loads of things. They've took our Salford plow. I'm trying to think what else they've took. It's been a couple of days since I've been down here. I hope all the animals are okay. I'm just going to have to quickly run. We're going to have to get a locksmith to come and fix this door. Or get somebody to come and fix this door. It's definitely been broken open. Whoa, 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 where's my pump? My pump's been ripped out of the ground. There's a remaining bit of the pump. What on earth is going on? Well, that's locked. That has an alarm system on it. So if that door opens, we do get notified. The same as the garage doors over there. <laughs> oh, we've had thieves. Really? In this area? Nothing happens. Apart from a couple of joy riders, that trail has been moved. I did not leave that there. I did put this in the big unit over there. So that's obviously been moved over there, unless somebody was trying to hide it from that road. Hmm. Okay, well, okay. Uh, oh. I stole my barrel weight? Seriously? I do, I do realise and I do know that the greenhouses have gone before me and my partner left. We was talking about it. She's decided to do away with the greenhouses. We're going to level all this out. And she is thinking about putting a little field in here. I have no idea what, but... Uh, yeah, okay. Let's have a look at these. Okay, it looks like someone's tried to hack at these bars with a pry bar. But luckily we had these here. Because if they had taken the truck or the semi in the trailer, we would have been in serious trouble. Let's have a look at this gate. Oh, wow, they've tried to pry open all these bars. Did not expect that at all. 
go to help out at, at his farm, come back. Things have been stolen. The cows seem all right. They're not phased. How are you, buddy? Hey, are you okay? They've ripped your pump out too. All I can see is the remainder of the pipe. They've just blocked it off. Are you serious? Who would do this? You've got to be kidding me. Uh, I, <coughs> I gotta check. That door's open. Oh, don't tell me the tractor's been stolen. Gotta make sure these are okay. Oh yeah, the trucks are fine. And I have tried to pry this door open. So they obviously did try to take these. Let's have a look at this one. Oh, that's, just, that's not good. We are going to have to ring the police. Let's just climb down here. That is bolted. We do have a big, big wooden bar that can go across the inside, so you can't get in there. The Fiat 6566 has gone. And it's like they've literally just gone for all our, our vintage equipment. But surely, you know, they would have took this. Why did they leave this? Unless they was in a hurry or got scared off. Oh, you can see tyre tracks. That looks like a big vehicle. Whatever they used. Oh yeah, it goes all the way up here. How did I not see this? Because I went down that side. Look at these tracks. Looks like they made a fair few trips. They obviously drove... The, oh, they must have drove the Fiat. Look at the... You can see the tractor trails. We haven't been here for about three days. There's tractor trails, semi-trails... Where does it go? Let's have a look. So it goes round here. That's obviously where they ripped out the pump for the water for the cows. Uh, we've got trails leading up here. They obviously used the tractor that they stole, the Fiat, to pull something. Are you serious? This really isn't what we what we need. They must have been planning on using that trailer as well. Okay. That's slightly... Well, that is really concerning. That is a lot of money in equipment, especially the four-strike harvester. Luckily, we do have the harvester. We can get that money back from the insurance. Seriously, I didn't really get to use the thing. Um, uh, let's, just, let's just shut these doors. Okay, so they couldn't get in there, but this door is able to be opened. This is our Stroutman... Oh, come on, they stole the Stroutman trailer. Say, I've got the key for this door, so let's open this. Should just be the Fiat in here at the moment, the other Fiat. Okay, so they couldn't get in here. There we go, let's get that closed. Okay, so I'm making the list. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. All the other stuff are pretty small. The, the biggest issue is they stole the Fiat, the Fiat 6566 tractor and they also stole our Russell Mash, uh, a force harvester with uh, the both headers. Because uh, I did move the John Deere and that out the way that is stored in the the big one, big storage unit with the alarm over there. I also put items 
where we do have all of our seed. Oh yeah, look at this, you can see all these tracks. Hey, this must have been a semi. Look at this turning circle. Somebody knew we was leaving. Oh no. Having a look around, I still haven't seen our animal trailer. So they must have took that as well. If they took the animal trailer, why haven't they taken any of the animals? We're going to have to count. Let's have a look. Is Stanley still here? Oh, yeah, Stanley's there. Just counting our pigs. Okay, so they haven't taken any pigs. Let's jump over this. Really didn't expect this. Just thought I'd do a nice vlog, returning back to the farm. To get this, I mean, it's just disastrous. Looks like they tried to move this, nudge. But you know, you'd need the big John Deere to move this thing, it is full of water. And uh, our small tractors really aren't powerful enough to pull this thing. Right, so let's count all of our cows. Just climb over here. Okay, let's have a look. You can't, you've not even touched your straw bales. Come on. These small straw bales. I haven't seen the small New Holland baler. Go, whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down. Okay, so let's count the cows. Let's have a look. Watch out the way. I'm trying to count you all. Yeah. Okay, okay, right, so all the cows are still here. Which is good. Just absolutely devastated. Um a lot of money that has been stolen from the farm. Some of it we do have insurance on, but some of the older machinery we brought off friends. And locals, we just didn't have insurance on. So we've lost those. I'm just glad they wasn't able to get into the big unit over there, the brick one. Because they had, our, they had our big John Deere and our big cedar. And had they got into our storage unit over there with all the seed, that would have been a very, very big expense had they taken all of that. Tell you what though, they could have took the rooster. I wouldn't mind if he went. He, he really doesn't like me. But yeah, these tracks. Right, so I have made a mental note. Right, so let's just have another quick look in here. It's just devastating. You go out to help a friend come back. This has been pry barred open and forced. So whatever they had. This did have a big, big bar going across. I must have used something with a lot of put, a lot of force. So, what's been taken? All, what I can think is so far is our force rate harvester and both headers have gone for that. We've uh, lost our small John, um, our small New Holland baler. We have the Fanex Tedder, our John Deere Cedar, the Salford Plow, uh, our Strautman Trailer, the Freight 6566, the Washelmas KT10, and our Animal Trailer, along with our Barrel Weight. That's gone. Looks like somebody tried lifting this up. They must have tried doing it by hand. Basically, it looks like they've just gone for the stuff they could quickly grab and chuck on a flatbed. But the harvester. How would people not know a harvester? And out of both harvesters, this one's better. It has the Capello header. Why would they take the Forshrit harvester? We've not even had it that long. And surely they would have taken this, the Thunder Creek. It's full of, uh... It's full. Shake that. Just... Yeah, that's full. 
Why didn't they take that? Really weird. Why would somebody do this? Oh, well, what a devastating vlog this is. Our farm has been broken into. Jeez, oh, I'm really happy they didn't get into the grey unit over there. That's where our John Deere cedar and our big cultivator. No, our John Deere tractor and our big cedar and uh, our red case cultivator is. And also our storage unit with all the seed, fertilizer, and the lime that has our uh, loading. Has our little yellow beastie in there that does all the heavy lifting. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to ring my partner. We'll have to inform the police. I'm going to let the local farmers know in the area. And, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, my phone's vibrating. Okay, I'll just answer this call and then I'll uh, continue the vlog. Okay, so I've just got off the phone. Uh, the stores had some break in. Uh, some things have been stolen out of there. And also, our farmer friend. Uh, who we brought the Hurleyman off, he has been hit as well. They stole two of his tractors, they stole three of his trailers, uh, they stole his semi, and they've also stabbed a lot of holes in some very important equipment of his. And one of the tractors they stole was his track challenger. He's got to be absolutely devastated. Um... Uh, but it's, oh, we're a harvester down, right? So I'm gonna have to go in. I'm gonna have to uh, ring my partner, inform her what's happened, ring the insurance companies, ring the police, and hopefully, in the next vlog, we uh, can get things sorted. We'll have to look at getting the insurance money back and buying some replacement equipment. Really, not the start I'd want to a vlog, but. Uh, Oh dear, well this is uh, a bad day on Rustic Root Farms. Surely we can get some insurance money back and uh, claim on this and uh, yeah, hopefully the police can catch whoever has done this. Till then I'll see you all very soon on this, a sad day for Rustic Root Farms. See you all very soon.